what's going on YouTube you know what time it is let's go drop by my loco Jimmy John's located on Hardison hey what's going on YouTube is your Asian phenom back with another exciting lunchtime food review today I went to Jimmy John's to try the number five which is called the Vito Let's see what it says. The original Italian sub with Genoa salami, provolone, capicola, onion, lettuce, tomato, and real tasty Italian vinaigrette. Hot peppers by request. Oh man, I didn't know that. So that's five seventy five. You know, it's starting to sound a little bit familiar. Hopefully, I didn't review this already. But on top of that, I got two one day old bread, fifty cents each. Both of them for a dollar. Can't beat that price. Of course, check out my review later on that when I get home. Today, let's get this started. One thing at a time. Here we go. Jimmy John's, always good. Fresh. Fast. Made to order. Got that very tasty white bread. Fresh. Look at that. None of that fake, foamy, crappy bread that we know that comes from Subway. There we go. You got the onions, shredded lettuce. That's that cheese I was talking about. The Genoa salami. Oh, it looks like there's two types. Okay, I can't appreciate that. Let's see what it says. Actually, it is. Salami and provolone capicola, Genoa salami. I don't know what I'm talking about. Okay, that's enough. That's a nice amount of meat. Of course, you can never complain with more. Okay, what's this doing on the bottom? That doesn't look like salami, but I'm not complaining. Okay. Oh, wait, that's cheese, my bad. You got four slices of uh, red tomatoes. Finish off with some more onions. Look at that bread. Look at how exciting the bread is compared to Subway's. Let's get started. The bread is very tasty, fresh. I love the bread. One thing that Jimmy John is known for, the bread makes the sandwich. You know, all the other fresh ingredients just complements it. This Genoa salami tastes a little bit salty, a little bit on the tad on the salty side, but the vegetables are fresh and tasty. Overall, I'm very happy with this sandwich. Five seventy-five. On a scale of one to hundred percent, I will give this a eighty-five percent. So, hope you guys enjoy this review. Can't wait to tear those up. Think of the possibilities I could do with those.